I thought the project worked really well. I think it helped uh, a lot of kids kind of understand and kind of get more involved and get more informed. Um, I know our group personally, I learned a lot. I learned a lot for my future and what I can really do to kind of help. And so I really think it worked great. I thought it was good to raise awareness about water because I wasn't, I didn't know a lot of the statistics that were brought up. I felt it was a good project. I mean, the whole, when we did things in class, it was more, Miss Off gave us an idea and that was fine, but there wasn't really any real drive to accomplish something other than for yourself. But doing this kind of a project, it, you have a more of a reason to do it. and You feel more compelled to try harder, find something new, because not only is it a chance to help out society with uh, awareness about water conservation, but also with a being able to get your st your work out more on a uh, lo local, nationwide, or even worldwide level. So there was always that possibility that, I, I don't know about them, but it drove me to work harder and try my best with that. So, yeah, I like the project a lot. Uh, I thought it was a good project. Uh, I thought it was a lot of fun. Um, it was kind of interesting to like work with other people because usually we just do uh, self projects. Um, I thought it was fun though because um, I don't know we we all got to work together and we all like had different parts that we had to do, but it was like for one uh, like united thing. And, like it was actually uh, like a global issue, and like usually we just do kind of things that we get to choose. And, uh, Bob said it was good to do something that we don't normally do the group projects, we just do individual stuff and it's nice to like rely on each other and bank on those ideas and stuff and work off of that, so I like that. Like some of the facts that we all learned, that how um, much of an issue this is and how much of a growing issue and also a surprising fact like with the way that we work together, we um, all collaborated really well and we did good with, uh, I think, um, with like feeding off of other people's ideas. I think we all did a really good job getting the message across that we were planning on making people think a lot more than most of our projects. Like we really had to do a lot of research and um, it made everyone really aware on the issue. It was really like involved, like it was like a real kind of world issue that really affects a lot of people so that was kind of cool. I thought it was just kind of like difficult because there's so many ideas but like to just think of one like main idea, I thought that was kind of pretty difficult to think of like make a poster or like make a bumper sticker that was catchy but still people got like a point. I thought that was pretty tough. I think it's a good way of course uh, other people to be aware just as when we did our project we became more aware so if they do it then they'll be they'll uh, see the problems and also they'll be able to spread it on to other students like their peers and stuff just as we are right now. So it's a good way to spread to uh, other generations and yeah it'd be a good idea. Maybe working through uh, if kids at home were capable of hooking up via webcam, being able to work, uh, have groups all connected even when they're not in school, being able to bounce ideas off each other that you might not be able to get while um, at school during school hours. Maybe bumping it down to a grade school level, um, not nearly to the same extent of what we're doing, but kids making posters, at least getting them understanding that because they're the ones that are going to come after us so we at least need their support when kids of our age will be in political office you get to have people to vote for you so if you looked at it from that respect you need even younger generations to understand the concept of water conservation too. Um, that water is not an, an unlimited resource and that one day it's going to be gone if we keep using it like we do. So you need to learn to save it or one day it's just not going to be there. Definitely after going through this, I, I, I know personally I almost see water as, as a commodity, as something to be valued rather than just water that has always come out of the tab. Um, I mean it, it's, it's a resource and you expend it just like any other resource and we kind of we need to 